And Cervelli. And Cervelli goes down. He's in some pain right there. And Todd Tomzik and Clint Hurdle make what has become a familiar trip from that dugout to that area behind home plate. Chris Stewart was watching. Cervelli. Came down, got him on top of the knee. It was a slider, so it was breaking down to begin with, and then just ticked. My guess is Francisco Cervelli will not have his knee on the ground anymore. He'll have it, he'll be in a traditional squat, and then that wouldn't have uh, happened. It would have just hit the shin guard, but because he had his shin guard actually in the dirt facing downward, he didn't, uh, he left himself exposed, and that's where he got hit. I don't think he'll be in a uh, one of those crouches where you put your shin guard straight down in the dirt for a while. See how his left shin guard is just right down in the dirt. His knee is in the dirt. Stay in the ball game. See those shin guards, uh, they, they come up very high yeah, too. They do. Right? A little bit higher than the, yeah, in the old days. It was just the, the knee right. protection, and that was it. Those yeah. other two things weren't even on there. Mm -hmm. uh, he's got a little extra up there, and still didn't work. He strikes out. Frazier does Liriano number six. Knee right back down in the same spot. Like I said, he wouldn't do that again. He did on the next pitch. Now he's buying himself some time limping to the mound. And, and now Clint Hurdle and uh, Todd Thompson are going to have to come out again. So Valley, uh, maybe not going to be able to continue in this ball game. You know, maybe that's why he did put his knee back down on the next pitch because he just couldn't hold himself up. Stewart is getting ready. Savelli is going to come out of this ball game. Looks like Clint Hurdle. No, I think he's going to stay in. He's oh, going back he? to the plate. Well, Clint Hurdle has his arm around him as if he's going to try and say, "Let's get out of here." No, he's going to stay in. They weren't, they weren't walking toward the dugout. They walked toward home plate. Uh, just looking at the way Clint Hurdle had his arm around him as if to say, "You know, you know, if you don't." Feel like you can continue. Let's get you out of here. 